Welcome, we will be using Mac for this demo. In this video, we will cover how to export citations from EndNote 20 into Microsoft Excel for Mac. Sometimes, it is necessary to export citations into Microsoft Excel for data analysis. This is a multi-step process. To do this, first, we need to tell EndNote which parts of the citations we want to export. Second, which citations we want to export. And finally, the format we want to save them in. The first step is selecting which parts of the citation we wish to export. We can do this by editing the tab delimited output style. First, go to Tools and select Output Styles. If you do not see tab delimited on the list, click on Open Style Manager and select it from the list. And then press Edit. A pop-up window will appear where we have to specify our options. Go to Bibliography and Templates. You will see all of the fields of a citation available for export. Remove all of the ones you do not need to export. Each field will be a column in Excel. Make sure each field is separated by a right pointing arrow or a tab. For the purposes of this video, I will only include author, year, title, publisher, volume, number, page, and name a database. Click on File, Save As, and name it Tab Delimited Copy 2, and then press Save. This will ensure that the original Tab Delimited output style will remain unchanged. We now have to tell EndNote which citations we wish to export. In the Active EndNote library, select the preferred citations. If you would like to export all citations in a library, then on the main menu, go to Edit and select All. If you only want a selection of your citations, you have to select the preferred citations to export. It is important to remove carriage returns so that the data can be inserted in Excel cells correctly. Click on Library, and then Find and Replace. Under In, select any field, place the cursor in the Find box, click on Insert Special, and Carriage Return. In the Replace With box, type the following symbols. Click Change and press OK. Wait a few minutes to let the command run on all your references. Once it is finished, it will prompt you to click OK. Now your references are ready for export. With the citation still selected, in the main menu, go to File and Export. A pop-up window will appear with options. Change the output style to Tab Delimited Copy 2 or the name of the style you just saved. If you do not see the output style you just saved listed in the output style options, click on select another style and scroll down until you see it. Under save as, enter the file name and select the location where you want to save the file on your hard drive. Make sure the Save File Type As field says Text Only, and the Output Style is Tab Delimited Copy 2, or the name of the style you just saved. Click Save. Now we will go into Excel and import the data from the text file we saved. Open Microsoft Excel and go to the Data tab. Click on Get External Data and Import Text File. Find the text file we just saved and click Get Data. Follow the prompts in the Text Import Wizard. There are usually three steps. Step 1, we select the data type as delimited. Then we select Next. Step 2, we select the delimited tab and press Next. And then Step 3, we select a general data column and we click on Finish and OK. We can now format our data as a table in Excel. There are many different ways to format a table in Excel. Before we do this, insert a row at the very top of the table and add the headers describing our citation fields.
You have now completed this video. Thanks for watching.